Hello, this is Mohammed from School of Vocational Engineering Health and Sciences. Uh, today I'm going to show you how actually you can download from iExplore, which is a staff access database for um, staffs to actually download the student information of their academic um, ID and uh, student email and such. And so that you can use it for Blackboard so that it can be imported on the Blackboard Grade Center by different sections or groups for different streams. So I have a macro enabled uh, Excel spreadsheet which I've been given uh, some time back. So I'll use that tool to actually split the number of students of the same course, but they should be in different sections for different uh, streams or different disciplines in the Blackboard uh, Grid Center. So uh, let's start. So this is how I'm going to access the Explorer. So I'm going RMIT page. And under staffs, you go to student program course administration and log in by your credentials and then click student administration and you would find I explore there. Go list by course class, give details of your. Um, course so I'm using an associate degree engineering project course as an example we, where we have six streams of um, courses mechanical civil electrical uh, networking aerospace and such so I'm clicking search here and instead of clicking by individual class number what I'm doing not this one please do not click export results to Excel I repeat do not click this one click this one where it says export class list for all results it's downloading just waiting for the download to happen and by the time it's downloading what I do I just go to my download folder where I have the macro I turn it on click enable editing macro has been disabled click enable content now if my download has been there I'm still waiting the download to happen so it's downloaded so the macro I just um, enabled Excel spreadsheet I just opened so from there I select my export file for my download folder do not change anything uh, do not delete any information from the folder uh, downloaded the file you downloaded do not do anything from there click here section ID that is important and click start and that's done so click yes click close all of this save it and now in your download folder you'll see group members and group CSV two files the group CSV will show you all the groups been created by the section number CR4C, CR4A and as such and in your group members file you would see all the students they are under different section code which is CR4C, NR4A, CR4B and such so I'm going to use this file two files in RMIT Learning Hub which is the blackboard and I'm going to go there straight now I can close this so the RMIT Learning Hub now I'm going there click Learning Hub and then I'm going to my relevant course which is ONG1068 Just waiting for the screen to come up and then I'm going groups users and groups click groups and go import and now import group members and input groups so I'll actually import two files that I just created by that tool which is the 
backwardable Excel spreadsheet. So I go under my group members, I click that group members file and under my groups, I click my groups file. Click submit and you see all the students which was under this course ONG 106 say some 280 now they are divided under different groups automatically by the tool so AR4A has got 28 CR4A has 34 and so on so that we'll be using for our spark plus um, templated CSV file later on so please stay tuned to watch my video regarding how we can get this group information uh, for Spark Plus to create the peer review assessments. Thank you for watching.